start with Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right. Good morning. Next, I have is the approval of today's agenda. Make a motion to approve the agenda for today. I will second. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, all in favor say aye. 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 Motion carries. Next is approval of minutes of 314 and 316 of 22. Make a motion to approve. I will second. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, all in favor say aye. 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 Motion carries. Now I have is approval of claims for payment of 323.22. Make a motion to approve the March 23rd of 22 claims for payment. I will second. So move and second it. Any discussion? Hearing none, all in favor say aye. 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 Motion carries. Secondary roads. Got a utility permit. I will make a motion to approve utility permit number UT 22 002. Or underground permanent installation from by Heart of Iowa Ventures LLC. I will second. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Or installing fiber optic cable and beds. We have a discussion. Hearing no more. All in favor say aye. 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 Motion carries. Now we have is consideration of a resolution on the bridge weight limit postings. Taylor, you want to talk about these? Yep. So uh, we just got it back from our bridge inspectors. Uh, there was no new bridges to add to the system. That's so good. that good. Exactly. That's been my first in a while. Uh, so there's only a few changes. So yeah, I thought it was a pretty easy one to do. You got the highlights on the changes? Uh, they're bolded on there. Um, let's see. There's one over the South Fork. <laughs> on D Avenue, that one is going from 20 to 10. Uh, there's one on 220th, just off S27, that one's going from 25 to 15. Uh, same 25 to 15 on 195th, uh, southeast of Owasa. And then uh, 20 to 15 on 245th, southeast of Eldora. That might be it. No, there's two more. Okay, yep. Y Avenue, just north of Witten, it went from 12 to 6. So, yeah. and we've had net, a net positive. There was more that went legal than didn't. So I'll take it. <laughs> and we ask that people respect these weight limits so the bridges last longer. Correct. The ones that you see change every year, they're the ones that you can tell people aren't respecting. And at some point, we can't fix them as fast as they go down. <laughs> We're at that point, yeah. So the longer we can respect the limits, the longer bridge can hold up. Yep. I can consider that resolution if you so choose. I will make a motion to approve the resolution on the bridge weight limit postings. I will second. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, roll call. Lance? Aye. Renee? Aye. Most curious. Next is consideration to enter temporary 2080 agreement for the VA services. This is something that uh, we're going to share with Grundy County for a short period of time, just to get us through. So I will make a motion to approve the Hardin Grundy County Veterans Affairs Administrator Agreement. I will second that. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Looks like we'll be paying them twenty-one sixty-five an hour plus mileage um, if they need to come to Hardin County, or if they otherwise they can maybe do this by phone. I don't know. Any other discussion? Hearing no more. Roll call. Lance. Aye. Renee. Aye. No queries. Now I have is an application for the use of. Hardin County Courthouse grounds. Make a motion to approve the application for use of the Hardin County Courthouse grounds for the date of 9 17 22 from 7 a.m. until 1 p.m. The event is going to be Constitution Day. Um, it's an educational and patriotic celebration. And this is an application submitted by Daryl Meyer. I will second that. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? 
He did this last year, so I'm like, pretty good event. It was a good event. Any other discussion? <clears throat> Hearing no more, all in favor say aye. 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 Motion carries. Now I have is consideration to approve Hardin County Statement of Safety Policy and Hardin County Safety Committee. We'll make a motion to approve the Hardin County Statement of Safety Policy. I will second that and move and seconded. Any discussion on this uh, bottom one? We have an asterisk by Kerry Calloway Morton. Is this? We have the sheriff and the chief deputy. So as is she with you guys or is she going to be part of this committee? Do you know? Part of the committee is my understanding. Okay. Yeah, part I, of the committee. She's I just been, didn't know what the asterisk meant. I think because she's a name, not a position, I guess. Yeah, she's I, I, yeah, I guess I oversaw that or overlooked that. Yeah, she because of uh, security. Um, she's done that as part of a, just the okay. general security, and she also works with uh, Matt and Michael on like the um, buzzers, the panic alarms, and things like that. So, okay, I, I just wanted clarification on yeah. the asterisk. So the asterisk needs to be removed. All right, I'll get that removed. Any other discussion? There no more. All in favor say aye. 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 Which carries. Now I have is to set date to receive bids for Moeen County Home Cemetery. We've been informed that uh, the person doing it will no longer be doing it and we need to find somebody to go do that. Yeah. So if we would need to publish that in the paper, can that be get that out like within a week or so? Would that be possible, or what would you recommend? Yeah, I could get it out next week. Okay. Um, would April 13th be too soon, do you think? So I could put it in tomorrow to be published in the papers next week. So that would be, it would should be published if they have room should be published on Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. Next week. Yeah. Okay. So then when you when are you thinking? April 13th. April 13th. So that would give them that's three weeks from yeah. today, I think. So that's what you think sufficient. Okay. All right. I'll make a motion to set April 13th as the date to receive bids for mowing the county home cemetery. I will second that. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion to be um, received by 8.30 in the morning? Yeah, that would be good. Um, is this is this just on an annual basis or is this for, do we set it for a number of years? I don't remember what we've done in the past. He did it for so many years, I don't remember. Let's just do it annually. We just do it annually? Let's just do it annually this year and we'll get, get some printed up for the next time. Okay. Um, 8.30 to the auditor's office. Yes. Okay. Any other discussion? Hearing no more, all in favor say aye. 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 Motion carries. Now I have is a change of status in Sheriff's Department. Make a motion to approve the change of status for Colin Chinnery. It's as of March 28th, 2022. It's higher, a hiring of full time as communications operator at $20 an hour. I will second that. It's been moved and seconded. Any discussion? Hearing none, all in favor say aye. 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 Motion carries. Other business, Taylor. Yeah, I got two things. Okay, so here's the picture of the situation so you'll at least know what we're talking about. So that is outside Pine Lake Corn Processors at the intersection just north of Highway 20 and S56. Uh, so a representative of the pipeline stopped in yesterday and to do this, they're going to need to build something kind of at the edge of, apparently that's a right away for a road that was never there. We kind of wondered if it was something that they wanted, would have wanted at one time, maybe like a secondary access in. I think it was the original road, wasn't it? I don't know. I thought that was further south. You're right. It was. Yeah. So I'm, I'm not sure neither of you were here when that went in either, correct? Mm -hmm. So 
Yeah, so our thought was, so they wanted a letter from us stating that we had no use for that as a road. Me and Joe both thought, why don't we just vacate it? You know, that we have no purpose for it. The only one that would would be combined like corn processor. So why not just give back to them if they want to build themselves a road, they can build themselves a road. So that's the way we were thinking, unless you guys have a different opinion about. So it would be corn, kind of like corn processor property. Yeah, yeah, yep. They own on both sides of the road. So yeah, okay. Why not just let them have it? Mm -hmm. And then that way, if they need to build something for the pipeline, that's their problem. Okay. Yeah. From, from your opinion, though, there's a road there that basically we're vacating that never was a road. Correct. So, yeah, I mean, you know, they're farming it right now. That's a little bit of tax revenue you're missing out on, you know. We have a, you know, we have tons of those situations. So, if one comes to our attention, we might as well give it back. Well, that needs to, uh, you need to put something together. Obviously, we can't act on it today. Yep. I just kind of wanted to see if you guys were agreed, like, yep, let's just continue to wait down that path. Looks like it makes sense to me. Yep. I mean, there's, like you said, there's absolutely nothing there in their farm on it. So I would like to go back and see why they originally <laughs> did it. Yeah. We'll see if we can find anything, but I don't know. So for, for now, I'd like a little more research on as to why it's there. Do like you guys have an approximate year of when that was all done? Good question. 2000 something. Yeah, around the same time as Highway 20 on? No, it was done before then, I think. All right, sounds good. I'll do my research. Yeah, I know it was done before 21 then. There's probably, I mean, go back to when they purchased the property, I suppose, or something. Yeah, we'll look into it. Yeah. We'll see if we, if we can find anything. Okay. Yeah, I just. Before I answer, I don't I want to know why. Yep, that's fine. What's your other thing? Okay, this is the best part. So in less than a month, our five-year plans are due to the DOT. Okay. So usually this time is you know the 11th minute to midnight, or you know, mm -hmm. I would be bringing you this stuff in to approve. And with the new federal laws, the DOT has said we all we have to change some things, but it's still subject to change. So in other words, I don't know what's going on right now. So yeah. So I just kind of updating you on this five when we do our five year plan, we might be approving it there at the last second because because that's how you, hey, you have to. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So yeah, I'm not sure what's going on with federal aid, federal money and state money, and it sounds like they don't know either. So I can't say I'm surprised, but it has to do with the new uh, federal the IIJA, the Infrastructure Investment and Jobs Act. So, so everybody, everybody will be in the same boat. It's not just correct. Yep. Know, so, okay. yep. Good to know. Thank you. <laughs> yep. Anything else for us? Avoid Disneyland, the rough down here. There. Mm -hmm. Disney World. <laughs> Disney World. World. Yep. Yep. Just kidding. Uh, other business, Michelle. I have some. Yes. Um, just a reminder again. Um, property taxes are due by March thirty first. And then I'd like to um, inform the public that our office will be closed on April 5th um, for all staff training. And so we're gonna try to learn some new things and improve our skills and so we can serve the public a little bit better. So that's April 5th, that's a Tuesday. Tuesday, April 5th. Yep. Okay. Yeah, and that'll take out our whole entire office. So. Is that right. training held here or is it somewhere here? No, we're going to, um, it's district mm -hmm. one treasure training. So okay. we're going to, um, thanks. I escaped me where we're going. Independence, um, artist, artist yeah, in our district. So, Boy, okay. yeah, so it will be a trip for us, but um, it's motor vehicle, driver's license and tax training. So I feel it's really good for my staff to be able to get some training um, with our office being small, it's hard to um, send people to, to separate trainings mm -hmm. to get that same. Yeah. Can you do this stuff in your office? <laughs> I'm kidding. We like to participate in our district <laughs> training. So it's all our, our district one treasures okay. are getting together. So it'll be a, a large group because um, yep. there's several counties within our district and I'm looking forward to it uh, for my staff to be able to mingle with their peers and 
mm -hmm. and do some some training and everybody has different ideas in their office it'd be nice if we could go to other treasurer's offices and just see kind of how they operate yeah but time doesn't allow us to do that but so, so I feel that's a good good thing for our staff and um hopefully the public will understand that we're just trying to better ourselves so we can better serve them yeah okay thank okay. you anything else Time to Okay. Dave? Nothing. Only? John? Today is uh, Tornado Awareness Day, and the sirens in the communities in Hardin County will be sounding today at, uh, I think, 10, 10. Okay. after 10 15. 15. Okay. So, anything else for us? No. Okay. Ready? Nothing. Then I can ask for adjournment. Motion to adjourn. All right, well, second. It's been moved and seconded. All in favor say aye. 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 Most carries are adjourned. Are we practicing?